I'm representing, as I said, uh, Les Buitbea, non-governmental organization uh, from Kosovo. Officially, the organization has been established in uh, uh, 2014 and uh, with the vision for green and clean Kosovo and the mission to advocate, educate and cooperate for heritage protection and preservation in Kosovo. Uh, the vast major majority of uh, our projects and activities uh, are related to uh, environment protection, though uh, our organization has implemented few uh, projects uh, related to cultural heritage uh, from protection and promotion. Also, uh, personally, I have worked on the organizations that uh, dealt uh, with the culture, uh, cultural heritage and uh, the tourism. That's why I still keeping the legacy of the past of my career. We have implemented a heritage festival in Pea back in 2018 uh, with the students of a primary and art school from Pea in order to promote uh, natural and cultural heritage that uh, Pea municipality has. Uh, this was intended to be a continuous uh, festival uh, to become a traditional, but unfortunately we couldn't make uh, uh, funding funds for this project, so we stopped at that uh, uh, year. Then we had the project of uh, Youth Action for Sustainable Development, where we uh, have um, presented and introduced uh, uh, SDGs uh, related to uh, heritage management and promotion with the students of uh, secondary schools in Pea, and uh, implemented cultural natural heritage of uh, east of municipality and, uh, and Kosovo, again with uh, students coming from minority communities uh, of secondary schools in east of municipality. Currently we are implementing the cross-border uh, project in Macedonia and Albania, uh, eco-friendship, that tackle uh, the lack of youth capacities in heritage, uh, civic engagement, and uh, cross-cultural uh, experience, the exchange, and another uh, same with uh, uh, cooperation, uh, cross-border cooperation, uh, peace path projects, again with uh, youth from Albania and Macedonia. So this is more or less uh, introduction of uh, Leslie Pea engagement in uh, heritage uh, heritage promotion. Western Kosovo, uh, Pea region actually is uh, consisted by six municipalities, by Pea, Jakova as uh, the bigger uh, cities in the region. Then we have uh, Isto, Klina, and Dechan, and the unique municipalities which are a much smaller municipality. And of course, uh, being a bigger municipalities and uh, much of older cities, Pea uh, and Jakova do have much more uh, heritage than other municipalities. As you can see here uh, in, the, in the presentation, Pea uh, has uh, three, has diverse actually, uh, cultural heritage, religious, and uh, traditional uh, uh, local heritage. You can see uh, these three towers uh, at the beginning from the 19th uh, century, which are uh, stone houses, traditional uh, local stone houses. Uh, Hamam from 15th century, uh, guest house from 19th century, which is currently serves as the uh, ethnographic museum. Uh, the mill of uh, national hero Hajizeka from 19th century. Old Bazaar of Pea, uh, the famous one in the region uh, from 19th century. Unfortunately, uh, Old Bazaar in Pea and in Jakova during the history has been burned and destroyed uh, four times. 
And the uh, last one was burned and destroyed during the last war in 1999. And unfortunately, a lot of heritage has been lost uh, during the last war. Uh, then we have uh, uh, Muslim, uh, Islamic, actually Islamic uh, uh, heritage, which is, uh, uh, we have a lot of uh, mosques in the city, but most prominent are Bayekli Mosque and Kushumbi Mosque. Uh, we have uh, uh, Orthodox heritage, which is uh, patriarchy of Orthodox Church from the uh, 16th century and the Catholic Church, uh, actually the Patriarchate is uh, under UNESCO protection and Catholic Church of St. Katharina from 19th century. Uh, Mr. Uh, Pea has uh, a lot of, in the list of uh, the cultural heritage sites, there are many, many other uh, sites, but those most prominent are uh, listed here. In regards to the intangible uh, heritage uh, related to uh, artisans, uh, traditional handicraft. Uh, they are still uh, active, though there is a risk that uh, we might lose these uh, artisans forever, which are hat makers, other knife makers, farrier, blacksmiths, wood processing, wood carvers, watch repair, shoemakers, traditional uh, female clothing. It's a very, very uh, important thing than a traditional instrument uh, maker. Alpe has a rich, uh, intangible uh, heritage in regards to uh, traditional uh, events. Uh, though we have as well the new uh, events in here uh, listed. It's, uh, artisans, uh, Basilicat Artisans Retail Space, St. George Day, Sheep Shearing Day in uh, Highland in Irovola, uh, in the National Park. Spring Blessing of Families and Agricultural Land Events. Traditional uh, hikers gathering, which are most organized by Montaigne's Association and uh, Mr. Jehovah, who is present here. Uh, we have uh, the traditional uh, communities uh, events which is uh, Alidu, Alidu, uh, gathering of uh, Bosnian community living in Pea. We have Rogova traditional games, uh, Highlanders uh, traditional games, very popular. Uh, theater festival, uh, we have a uh, classic guitar festival, artisan and traditional food fair, and uh, recently since uh, 10 years, maybe or more, it's the uh, Anibar Festival. In regards to the tangible heritage in Zakova, uh, it's the uh, Teche Teke uh, of Sheikh uh, Emin from 17th century, Hadoum Mosque, which is uh, located in the uh, old bazaar, very beautiful mosque, ethnographic museum. Uh, Harashia Inn, which is uh, a family house, uh, but now is turned into a restaurant. Uh, city clock tower, a family koshi tower, and the Jakova is uh, famous as well with uh, stone bridges uh, from the 17th, 18th, and 19th century. Also, there's a uh, famous uh, uh, old bazaar of uh, Japoa. There are uh, present uh, artisans as well, uh, as uh, similar to, to, to Pea artisans, but now in Japoa it's a specific uh, artisanship uh, of uh, pottery and uh, pipe maker. Unfortunately, uh, the last master, let's say, of uh, pipe maker has passed away a uh, year ago, so there's nobody inherited uh, part making uh, in, in Japoa. There are uh, many silversmiths, uh, saddles, and uh, traditional women uh, city uh, clothes. There are uh, other events in Japoa, St. George Day, like in many uh, other cities in Kosovo, which is uh, from pagan uh, periods. 
still uh, is go going on when uh, traditional sofas are provided, additional city music and food. And recently started uh, Marcia Jacobo Sphere, which is uh, a cross border with uh, Albania. In East Dog, as a smaller municipality, uh, there are few uh, tangible buildings. Uh, Mill Tower, uh, St. George Church, in, in, and the Stone Church in Zals from the 17th century. And not many artisans present in this municipality, apart from a uh, traditional women's uh, organization for Guru events. It's a uh, Damas dinner, very old traditional uh, dinner uh, organized in, in Kosovo. In Desan, there are many other. Uh, uh, tangible buildings, uh, mostly uh, stone houses, stone house uh, towers. Uh, in the city of Deshan and uh, in few rural areas of Deshan. But in Deshan we have a uh, uh, famous monastery, Orthodox monastery in Deshan, which is uh, from the 14th century under the UNESCO protection. Uh, there's no many uh, artisans present in Deshan, apart from the traditional clothing, clothing uh, female, when uh, in Deshan there are few events, a traditional uh, highland sheep shearing ritual, ladies days, uh, chestnut ride and lama's dinner, tangible buildings in Klina, uh, like just the uh, tower of Mark Yakai in Rana's village and Stonehouse uh, as a private museum in the Nava village, uh, traditional uh, uh, women uh, club. And we have this uh, uh, handicraft fair. And Unique is uh, famous by its uh, stone houses, uh, kulas, towers. Just a few of them are, are just listed here. Most famous ones, and uh, Choku Mosque, which is a uh, significant mosque in, in the municipality. Uh, there is a Rjergat uh, festival uh, in, organized every year, traditional festival in, in Union. This is more or less briefly about the tangible and intangible heritage of the region.